July is here, and you know what that means? That means I'm gonna recap all the fun we had in June because I'm a terrible daily vlogger, but I'm a really good monthly recapper. So here's my monthly recap. About mid-June, we had our last day of school, and it was kind of a bittersweet moment. My oldest daughter is gonna be heading into middle school, so she had to say goodbye to the only school she's known for the last, like, six years. To celebrate our first day of summer together, I took the kids to a place called the Family Fun Center, which is just this big building with arcade games and bumper boats, go-karts, jumping trampoline things. So the kids killed a couple hours in that place and uh, yeah, that made me real popular that day. I had two friends come in from out of town, which was super fun. Juliana came from Colorado with her friends and it was wonderful to see her. I took her on the, the Ferris wheel, we had lunch, we walked through Pike Place. I saw a guy playing the piano. And Liza, who is also a YouTuber, you should go check out her channel. She's really down to earth and sweet and friendly. And I took her on the Ferris wheel because when my friends come into town, uh, I take them on the Ferris wheel. So hey, if you're coming into Seattle and you wanna ride a Ferris wheel, I'm your girl. I'll take you on that thing, I'm not afraid. We also celebrated Father's Day. My husband has been a father now for 11 years. Round of applause for that guy. Oh, here's one of the gifts that my daughter, okay, so my daughter came home from school um, before school finished, obviously, and she's in tears because my other daughter had made fun of the Father's Day gift that she had made. And I was like, what? Why would she make fun of this? It's so cute. Is it a chef? And then the, my daughter started crying even harder because it's not a chef um, and her sister had been calling it a chef, which is why she started crying to begin with. This is actually her dad, my, my husband, wearing a chef's hat. So it's not a chef, um, but he looks a lot like my husband. I mean, this is spot on. I put it on Instagram and shared a picture of my husband holding this and I think it's an adorable Father's Day gift. Speaking of Instagram, if you're not following me over there, I do share a lot of my little outtakes from these videos. Um, sometimes I get a little carried away with my lip syncing at the end of videos, so I put a little bit on YouTube, but then I put a whole bunch of the rest of it on Instagram. Let's follow each other on Instagram. We went camping in June. That was like the highlight of our June. In fact, we tried to go camping every summer with my sisters and my brother and all of the cousins. It's a group excursion and it's a lot of fun. This time we went to a place called Cape Disappointment, which is in very South Washington. Don't let the name fool ya. Uh, it wasn't disappointing. It's a really beautiful area. Um, I think they just named it that to throw you off so you won't visit and then it will just kind of stay beautiful and untouched. Uh, but we touched it. Oh yeah, we didn't leave a stone unturned. We saw everything there is to see. Uh, I might do a video of our camping trip in and of itself because I think I took enough clips to kind of, um, you know, I don't want this one to be too long. And that wraps up our June. Altogether, it was a pretty successful month. I'm hoping for more good times in July. We've already celebrated the 4th, which was wonderful. Uh, my, my son has a birthday coming up, which is great. Oh, I'm going to New York. What? That's gonna have to have its own video. I'm really excited to go to um, a blogging conference called Blog Her in New York. So much fun stuff coming up. Wish me luck. Are you gonna have fun on your camping trip? Of course, it's your first one. You're gonna love it, I promise. I'm not gonna let you cry one time, except in the middle of the night, I'm not gonna get up to help you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, let's let them unpack. Oh.